श्रीमान वेकटनाथार्य कविताकेसरी वेदाताचार्य वर्गो मे सन्नीदत्ता सदा हृदय वी हेव बीन एंजॉइंग लॉर्ड कृष्णा द कौहर्ड बॉय गोपाला प्रांक्स द लीला एंड द रासक्रीडा जलक्रीडा सो आज ब्यूटिफुली portrayed and enjoyed by swami vedanta desikan in gopala vimsati it's our bhagyam to enjoy these wonderful shlokas along with the great vyakhyanams of purvacharyas so nicely indicated compiled by dr v n vedanta desikan swami especially anbil gopala charas vyakhyanam and trikudandai shri ragava patrachars samskrita vyakyanam his younger brother chinnamu shri ranganada bat patrachars manipravala vyakyanam anbil swami's amazing deep vyakyanams are all compiled by dr v n vedanta desikan swami and he has also given a simple lucid tamil commentary for people like us to understand and follow so uh, adian attempts to include these wonderful vyakyanams to the best of my abilities acharya kripai if at all if there is anything good it's because of the vyakyanams and the most beautiful shlokams and any mistake is only due to audience lack of gnanam in all these languages as well as the the lack of what do i say sincerity or bhakti please forgive me let's enjoy the 20th shlokam vaso hritva dinakara sutha sannidhau vallavina leelasmero jayati lalitam astita कुंदशाखा सव्रीडाभिस्तदनुवसने ताभिप्यम कामी कशिकमलोर्जलि याचम हियर् द गोपस्त्री वस्त्रापहरणलीला हौ द कृष्ण स्टोल ही वी वाज स्टीलिंग द क्लोथ्स ऑफ गोपी गोपस्त्री gopastri vastra paharanam and why did he do that and what was the leela let's enjoy gopastri vastra paharanam gopala carried away the garments the clothes which were kept by gopastris in the shore while they were taking bath which is actually a papam one should not take bath without any cloth which is a tabu under our shastras so krishna wanted to teach them a lesson that they should not go against the shastras they should abide by them so he took the garments to the top of punnai maram the kunda tree on the banks of the yamuna river and he sat on a branch of the tree smiling hanging those clothes in the branch they sought they prayed to him for the garments he was not willing to listen he wanted an anjali mudra he wanted folded hands by them he begged for it so to say nachiyar trimali andal also gives beautiful 10 pasurams on this he wanted he is because they were naked so they were so embarrassed and ashamed of their position 
they hid under the water and cried for krishna's giving away the clothes he said no way come out of the water and while they came out as requested by him they tried to cover their parts in order not to expose and they wanted anjali krishna said no anjali mudra i want kaikoop shaygai so what they did two two girls one holds the right hand and the other one holds the left hand where the other hand can cover their parts so toliyum nanum toludom and all says he said no way you should use both of your hands anyway the with a smile the unique unmatched permal what a lustful gopala he is he reigns victorious and gives back the clothes here on the banks of that emuna river it's so shining so here let's just dwell on this so krishna desired to play a prank on them because they went into the water against the shastras without any clothes so lost were they in their enjoyment on their own and is they were talking and discussing about krishna leela krishna's beauty and they did not notice that he had come and taken away the clothes he collected all their clothes and climbed quickly silently to the top of the tree when they had tired when they had finished their bath the young gopis came to the river bank and found to their dismay that everything was missing they went back to the waters and tried to locate with their eyes where their clothes were they looked in vain they were almost in tears he said gopis your clothes are here with me he spoke from the branch top then they looked up and to see krishna there i promise to give you if you come here and ask me for them come out i feel very sorry for all of you you have become so thin with fast other strenuous vratam you are observing so you cannot stand in the water for long you will catch cold come out the girls did not know what to do they looked at each other and they could not even be angry with krishna because they loved him so much they could not say no to krishna because krishna is is abiding by the shastras krishna please do not torment us with the with the pranks of yours you are a good boy we know please give our clothes back to us we are feeling cold we cannot bear oh brindavana chora please you should not per- persecute your your residents brindavana residents like us we are your dasis your slaves servants we will obey every one of your command please give our clothes to us or else so krishna said okay or else what will you do we will go to the king and complain about you krishna laughed how you will obey every command of my you say and all right this is my command come out and take your clothes pick up your clothes from me so they were trembling they tried to cover up with one hand and salute him with the other krishna said no anjali is made up of two palms my dear girls you should not salute with one so one girl gave one hand the other girl gave the other hand so it is strange he said no then they held their palms over their heads and walked towards the foot of the tree where krishna was sitting pleased with their utter devotion to him krishna gave them back their clothes it is very strange young go- girls had been deceived by krishna they had been ridiculed by him even though he was he was teaching them a lesson to be with shastras their clothes had been stolen by him yet they were not angry with him they stood looking at him bewitching drinking their bewitching beauty there was no anger in their minds because of this they loved him so so much they were crazy in love with him and that's the bhakti they had 
Swami Desikan enjoys this Vastrabakaranam. Vasu Gritva Dinakara Sudha Sannidau Vallavi Nam. So on the banks of the river, he is enjoying the prank that he played on the unsuspecting gopis who had left their clothes on the river bank. Here, Anbil Gopala Char says, This slokam is the equivalent of the Pala Dhyayam of Brahma Sutram. It deals with the event that took place on the banks of the Yamuna River when Krishna stole the garments of the gopis who were sporting in the river without clothes. He steals their clothes. Vallavina Vasa Hritva Dinakara Sutta Sannidav laid out on the banks of the Yamuna River, climbs a nearby Kunta tree with the Vastrams and has a big smile on his face. Leela Smera Lalitam Kunda Sakam Astitaha. So the gopis come out of the water to look for their Vastram. Antariyams and Uttariyams, both waist cloth and the upper cloth which are not anywhere then say they see the kitavaha rowdy baby gopalan on the branch of the tree sitting with all their clothing they beg him to give vastrams back to save them from the shivering cold they fold their hands savrilabi vasana abhyartyamanaha karakamalayo anjalim kurvan he responds to their Anjali and returns Kaschit Kame Jayati and becomes victorious here. Raksha Petshai Yacha Manaha He is he is seeking Anjali. He is seeking plead for Rakshai. He is pleading. He is asking. So Gopigal in Anjali Rakshai for him. Thus he becomes victorious. So the, this corresponds to the Pala Adhyayam, the fruits, the realization. Parabrahman, the gopis have attained the fruit, Parabrahma realization. We must look at the whole episode in a spirit, in a, in a bhavam which is not erotic because that will poison our minds when approaching Krishna episode. We are Sesha Bhuta souls. We are servant for Krishna. We are Sariram for Krishna. He is the master. He is the Atma. We are the Sariram. He is the Sariri and we are all Sariram. Our bodies to him. Gopala is Supreme God though in the Avataram, human form. He was really the Paramatma. He is there inside and outside of everything and every one of us. As such, we have to look at the episode as a Jivatma Paramatma interaction. The supreme fruit has been reaped by the Sariram, by realizing the Atma. So here, one needs to know that if we hug our hand, our wrist, that's, that's not wrong. It is, a, it is our body. If we love our finger, our hand, our wrist, that's nothing wrong. So Krishna follows in the same manner so it has to be understood in a subtle in a in a in a philosophical manner in a higher realm and not to be viewed with the tools that we possess with the senses and the sense organs this needs to be understood in the right perspective again sarvam shri krishna Paramastu. Kavitarki Kasimhaya Kalyana Gundashaline, Srimate Venkateshaya Vedanta Gurave Namaha, Danyosmi, Adiyan.